so x is having some numbers y is having some numbers right you are having x and your y so this is like the oh sorry this is only the pin codes and let's say this x to be only the pin codes okay so this x is only the pin codes and you want to subtract this using this y right so whose uh, return counts equals true okay subtracting both of them you want to subtract x minus y operands could not be subtracted because there are some 267 and 246 different methods common elements see uh, I, I have said you how to find the common elements right if you use the unique function we have done in the numpy right why don't you remember those things so we can do by subtracting their length sir length okay yeah so length of x minus the length of y so that will give you the number of uh, duplications right so that we are getting here to I think that if I see the length of uh, y is two thirty six. And length of x it is 267 so we can see here only that this is I want that what are those what are those pin codes which has been repeated my question was that what are those pin codes who is, like values have been repeated so you can also write it as let's say so let's value it is I see of pin codes I see I see of pin codes so this is your uh, like return counts I think someone has said this Anusha has it correct. Okay, so Z will be our things, um, X will be our count. So, even more, you can count the number of two or number of one. So, I can see here, like if you pass on to see the length of this X and this length of this uh, Z. So this is 236 and 236 right so this is having some two, 236 elements and it is saying that return counts you are getting right so it is uh, c or x over there so it says that the first thing is that is two it has been printed for two times that is one one zero zero one right so you can find these are the unique values right these are the unique values okay so but it is saying that uh, in this x or in this your uh, I see of pin code if you find if you see if you see the pin codes over there, if you just pass on that what are the pin codes that is a okay we, let's say this is s so saying if you just find the s of zero so that would be seven four now Seven four four one zero three. It's saying there. We are having unique one. It in the sorted way. Mm. Let's say this S is
so it's starting from and you can see like this first one which is your first has been repeated for two times and this is you can see one one zero zero one 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 zero zero one right similarly you will have sub so two three three four and if it is not one right so i want the things which are common i was expecting things which was common right so you can pass it like np dot where the x values is greater than 1 so it will say you the index locations where the values are greater than 1 that is 0 4 7 right so these are your values of this particular thing you can do one thing you can just store on these values as let's say this is the values and you can make a list of this and you can like store these things here copy it up you can like you can store these things these are the index values right and you can apply that like for x uh, for i in this values go and print s of uh, let's say repetitions so it will be printing s of i um, not s of i don't take it print let's say rep dot append the values of s dot i if you see your rep you will have this numbers which are repeated right so we'll get only the numbers which are repeated so these are the numbers which are like the uncommon if you see the length of this rep that is 24 and if you write 24 plus your so that is 260 so you're getting some uh, objects over there. Seven is still missing, right? There might be some things missed out here. But still, you can see uh, this is like you are getting the values which has been repeated for uh, the greater than one, right? So most are the rest are the ones, right? So we are not taking the ones over there, and we can just count on if we just see the negative of these things. If we subtract and see the length, that is, we are getting thirty-one values, right? including the ones too so if we remove that we are having 24s okay so like this you can find the index or like you can see if it's four uh, if you see the s of four so sir remove set there we'll get the remaining seven sorry length of s take length of s remove that set there we'll get the remaining two uh, I mean seven values all right we're getting see Oops. So length of s is like actually see length of s is the whole thing there you have you can pass length of a y so that is exactly the unique elements plus the repetitions okay so you will get 260 only because these have been repeated right these have been repeated for most of the times might some of them has been repeated for once or four or so like that so don't go with this this will like create a mess for you you just go with this concept that if you want to see right so you can find this number of somewhere something has been repeated for five times or like if you want to see the unique of x that is if you see on these things so uh, there is right, np dot unique of x so that will be having most probably one to five numbers right so you can even find out that where where this np values is equals equals to five it's saying only in the fourth position where the values are two one where the values are three unlike this you can find out the things over there
okay nice so you can find the pin codes and all these things right let's going back to the data and we'll see now you have cities too you have pin codes you have find out right so uh, if i say what is what are the number of pin codes what are the number of pin codes or what are the uh, city in which city or let's say if i if i am in this uh, let's say andhra pradesh right if i am in andhra pradesh so if i want to go to any uh, any particular like lab over there so if i have a pin code or let's say i want to go to a particular city so how many cities are there in the andhra pradesh which are having labs on the there yes so we want the cities in the andhra pradesh having labs there how will you find that try to understand what i am asking you want the number of cities in the andhra pradesh we have did this some moments before So that is Tirupati, and these are the, some of them, right? Understood. Got it. So you can find these things just by using. So in Andhra Pradesh, these are the cities having this value, uh, having these labs, and how you can find the labs over there of that particular. So you can find it by just by locating the Andhra Pradesh. So if you want to tab, if you wanted just a tabular sheet of only on the page, so you can find it like this. Um, these are the values, right? You are having Tirupati and this like all the things on this page. Like this, you can separate every. You can apply a for loop and then you can separate every particular states over there, and that will be a good data, right? So I okay, she has made something, Anusha. Let's copy this. Let's see. She is doing lock IC of state and on the Pradesh initials should be capital. State error. Before reading this IC. Before reading this IC. So her answer was according to the previous situation. So these are the values she are getting, right? That is, uh, she was locating the things. Now what she is locating, you can find. So she is locating the state, and then she is finding like in the state. Like in the column, how we used to locate a thing, right? How we used to locate, like in IC, and then we can find it any particular name. Let's say if I write first the column name, and then this, this, then the index value, right? Then the, let's say if you are finding for the six or like anything, so for the six, it's like for the seven, it would be also on the position. Like you have index values. 
uh, she has done that for the state you want the Andhra Pradesh value and those you and for those you want the locations of those things right easy understood I think you might have got that okay Hello, sir. yes so, can we use list of states in Andhra Pradesh using list can you find like the list no list of set of uh, list of ICO List of IC set. List of IC of state equals to Andhra Pradesh. Right? You are asking for this. List of IC of state equals equals to Andhra Pradesh. We're getting true and false values. So you will be getting uh, some uh, values right there. Like if you write for the true also, we're getting seven. Like that is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven values. Counting of that. Okay, sir. Hmm. Got it. Okay, sir. Okay. So. This is uh, how you can use the things and like you can work. Okay, now how many government laboratories are there in this whole data set? How many government laboratories are there? This question is to Yukta. I want to find the number of government laboratories. In the whole data set, I'm not talking about the, the particular state. I'll go with that later onwards. Now, I, if I only want to find the number of government laboratories in the whole data set, Len of IC and second. Okay, hmm. Len of IC type and length mm -hmm. or less. G capital L capital two sixty seven which shall have some two sixty seven states two sixty seven data we are having and we are getting length of this if also we apply list true and false so then we'll have to count it for true results that is T R U E 182 government laboratories understood Surya length will not work then go for the list and then you can just count it there. 
so that you can do it like for the private for the government and like for the uh, so how many types we have seen that collection site uh, the government laboratory and the private laboratories are there right so if i just write csns dot count plot and if i see only that x is equals to the type i want and um, i want my data from this ic or anything or let's say ic so this will be 180 around government one that is 182 correct collection site around three or five okay or something like that private is something 75 plus so you can go with this accordingly for the privates to to find out like so private would be coming in range of uh, 80 or 85 82 Good. The collection site will come in like something three or three right so you can get it like that but if I say if I say let's say if I just want that uh, I want the number of government laboratories in Maharashtra now I'm giving some particular state number of government laboratories in Maharashtra Yes. Uh, that is five. And they want yeah. Sir, yes. sir, in the case of type, can we, uh, means is it not possible to give Maharashtra over there, I mean state's name, directly? In this? Yeah. So state uh, and then you are passing for the government laboratories. So state is not having any uh, government laboratories in that particular column. You no, want I mean to pass Maharashtra. You want to pass Maharashtra. Like this, you want. Yeah. See? I'm spelling error, I think. Maharashtra. Uh, now you'll get something. So you got number private to government to. Right. You don't want the private ones. You only want the government ones. Now what? Apply and that will create the exactly the errors we got yesterday. Mm -hmm. Same one. What you will do? They've got the values out there. That is uh, number. So you counted for this Maharashtra. You got for Maharashtra, right? But now you want only the government laboratories there, not the private one. Hmm. Answers. Yes. Make this a new data frame and count the type of government. Count the type of government. New data frame is according to your data. You log in reshape your data.
So you have pipe over here and the states over here. Now you want the Maharashtra in this laboratory. You can apply this one, this particular state, or like you want to locate the number of private laboratories or state belonging or like type belonging to this particular city, right? So Anusha say to change this data frame. So I changed now what to do. She said count the type of government laboratories. Count the laboratories. So there are a lot of things. Count. I want only in the Maharashtra. So IC of state equals equal Maharashtra. Regarding government laboratory true or like uh, private laboratory and something like that, right? So I'm getting a details over there it's on the basis of this laboratories. Let's see what she writes. Not change sir with the code in the previous so let's say create a dummy DM variable and then locate okay. And Again, locate the type of comment. He is trying to say something which I am unable to understand. What she is saying to create some dummy variables. Okay. Sir, we have found government and private from Harasta, right? From there, is it not possible to get data of only government? Only government? Only yeah, yeah. In the before cell, can you please show that cell? Yes. Can you please scroll up? The above one, where we have found government and private of Maharashtra, right? There. Yes, sir. From this, we can separate only government, right? Is that not possible? Subtracting government. Yeah. Subtracting government. Like it's a kind of a string there, so that will not be possible. See, what you can do is just like a very basic one. You can write IC dot state, and you can search on for this. And then you can search for the values. It should be Maharashtra. Right. So in this state, you will be checking for the particular row that is government laboratories and where the values are coming as Maharashtra. That's it. You go for a list of these things and count for the values coming true. That is 20. Understood. So you can count on. Like you want to go in the state first. Then in the state column you are searching for this particular row. That is in this state you want like in this Arunachal Pradesh I want the number of government laboratories. And then I want their values to be where the values are coming as Maharashtra. Right. If you only find these things let's see what comes here. You, you just find these things let's say this so you are getting government laboratory and the position all these things right so you are not what you are doing is exactly you are just printing the states and their government laboratories over there you want here where the values are coming as Maharashtra and here you will be getting some true and false results for only in the Maharashtra so apart from this true, you are getting the values, right? The government laboratories over here. So if this is not a true a government laboratories, then might it would be up like a private one or something like this, right? So you are getting some details over here. Understood?
so you just count the things that is true objects and you got the values that is the number of government things okay. this is how you just tally up with the things you just work on the uh, things over there right let's stop it there